My dearest grandson, if you are reading this letter, I am no longer here on this earth, but I am with my Heavenly Father. I never taught much about the war or the contents inside of this chest, but it changed and shaped my life forever. During the war, I saw the best and worst in men, and I made it home to your grandmother thanks to the heroics of one man who never saw home ever again. This is this story, and the first time I have ever mentioned the events that led my way back home. It was 1944. We were in a small village in France. We were tasked with guarding a forward position and repelling attacks from the German army. The day was sunny, and I could still, even now, feel the sun on my cheek and the coolness of the crisp air. That picture of your gal? Still reading that book, huh? Yeah, of course. It's the only thing that keeps me going through this hellhole. It keeps me sane. Yeah, that's my gal. That's Betty. Where'd you meet her in Mobile? Yep. Right from Mobile, right where I'm from. She's beautiful. Thanks, man. Any news from Mobile? Nah. You know how it is. Mail's kind of hard to get up here on the front. Well, look, I say we rest here for a little bit before we get back on this patrol. How about some coffee? That sounds great. Hey, hey, it's gonna be okay. You're not gonna die. You're not gonna die. What the hell? Stand up for it. Here, hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. I'll help you. You're gonna be okay. George, George, why the hell did you stand up? Here, hold it. Hold it. You're not gonna die. You're not gonna die. Hold it. I want to. Watch out. Hold on to it. Hold on to it, okay? You're not gonna die. Stay with me, George. I should have I should have I should George, you're not gonna die. You're not gonna die. Stay with me. Hey! Hey! Stay with me. Stay with me. You're not gonna die. George! George, stay with me. George! 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 Damn it. Damn it. I feel. Yeah.
How you doing, Jerry? Turn around. What you doing out here? Huh? Uh, 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 no. You stay right there. Don't move. Don't move. Thirsty? 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 Speaking in English? No. What are you doing out here? Where's your friends at? Hey boy, you're real talkative, aren't you? I'm gonna have to worry about you running away. 
Ah, 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 ah. I lost my best friend today. Don't play with me. Thank you, sir. Where are you from? You like fish? Where are you from? What do you do? Don't fish it. Eat. You got kids? You're not gonna talk to me. I'm gonna read. So you sit there and you be quiet. And don't try to run off. I had a good one of these before you walked up. What are you doing? Got a bubble too. Thought you crouts were sacrilegious and didn't believe in God. I believe in God. Say that again. I believe in God. You speak English. Yeah. From uh, from Montgomery, Alabama. No kidding. I'm from Mobile. What are you doing in a kraut uniform? My, my dad, he served in the Great War and they called us. So, so you, you went I, back home? I answered the call. I never would have guessed that. Want a cigarette? You got family? Yeah. That's my girlfriend back home. That's my brother and his wife. Oh, your brother's in the service? He was. He died in the Philippines back in 42. I'm sorry to hear that. It's alright. War's hell. What kind of Christian are you anyway? Well, I felt that it was my duty to come over here. War brings out the best of Martian men. It has brought out the best of Martian men. And I wanted to bring out the best in men. This is my girl. This is my mother. Was this back home or when y'all got to Germany? Back home. You got a good looking family. Thank you. You scared? Yeah. No. I don't, don't even want to be here. I just, just want to go home. I'm ready for this war to be over. Well, I can tell you this. Actually, I can promise you this. You're going to go home. If it's the last thing I do in this war, you're going to go home. And I'm going to treat you just like the good Lord wanted me to treat others. I'm not going to hurt you. 
Just have faith. Pray about it. And you'll make it home. So what are you going to do after the war? I'm going to go back to the shipyard. Get out of here! You're going to get out of here. Just go. I can no, handle this. I'm not going to leave you. I'm not going to leave you. Get out of here! No! Alright. When I tell you to, you go. Go! Go! You're not going to die on me. Don't die on me. We're going to make it through this. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Hey, buddy, come on. Buddy. We need a medic! Come on, man. Father, who are you now? I will be my man. You will come. I will be mine. Don't worry, buddy. We're going to get a medic over here. Come on. I'll tell you what, man. We're going to get you home. That day is a day that echoes in my mind. I return home, recover from my wounds on the outside, but never recover from my wounds on the inside. I often thought about that young German soldier who I became brief friends with before he gave his life for mine. He gave his life for a stranger he had never met. Greater love have no man than to lay down his life for a friend. Because of that young German soldier, I made a family. And when you get to heaven, I will be waiting on you, along with that German soldier. Thank you.